Hello friends, welcome. In this video, we are going to see how we can view dashboard reports in Tally application. So if you go to the button dashboard, by default, you will be observing this trend. These dashboards will help you to understand the data in more efficient way, right? So by default, it is going to show sales trend, purchase trend, cash in and outflow, trading details, assets and liabilities, cash, inventory and all these reports and here it is that receivables and payable. Let's say out of this report I wanted to compare my bills receivable and bills payable. I don't want remaining tiles T-I-L-E-S. So if you wanted to remove any tile select the tile and click on the button remove tile or use the shortcut key alt plus d alt plus d is to delete a tile i am going to delete all these tiles so i wanted to see the difference between bills payable and bills receivable so now i have deleted all the tiles even if these tile also deleted you will see this empty screen so now this dashboard is going to show very empty if you wanted to add any tile in the right side you can see the option called as add a tile what report you want so if you click on the button show inactive you will see all the reporter styles you can choose any report you want i am looking now for i am looking for receivables and payables now the report has been added after clicking on that in the right side you can see expanded tile okay so this is the clear information if you wanted to see any each details press enter you will observe this kind of statements also let's say i don't want this data only i also want the trends so i click on the button configure tile and here you can see whether you want receivables or over overdue receivables or show payables or not or show overdue payable whether you want data or graph data and graph i am activating data and graph and whether you want a bar chart or a line chart i am selecting let's say bar chart and go to control here here you can see the data along with the bar chart if you don't want bar chart go to configure tile and you can click on the button instead of using bar chart i need a line chart so control g now the line has been added along with these receivable and payable i wanted to add one more tile i click on the button add a tile this time i am going to add let's say inventory i go and search for inventory i wanted to analyze my inventory also here also i can see my total inward and outward and stock availability in my business i click on the button expand to see the details or go to configure to change a report format also so whether you want only quantity or only value so based on the tile you selected if you go to configure the configuration options will keep changing based on the statement you selected so i selected inventory and go to configure i am going to say so you can go with single item wise also i go to single item i am selecting tally silver and control j and again i click on the button configure a tile i want not only the data data with a graph under that is i am looking for line so in this way i can say i can see the item the total closing balance if you wanted to see outward select outward and this is outward summary this is inward and if you press enter you will see more details also so this is a screen where you can see all reports you can view data along with the graphs information we'll see some other options also let's say when we open this dashboard i by default i have seen so many options and after that i removed so many tiles i added two tiles one is in the name of receivable and payable one more inventory whenever i come back again by default i'll see all the tiles but i need only these two so it is better to save this view i click on the button save view stating that let's say i go and say bills payable bills receivable and inventory so this is the name i'm going to add control a save so in future whenever i go to dashboard by default if i see so many options i can simply click on the button change view and we already given a name bills receivable bills payable and inventory if i once click on that all my dashboard will come back to my saved view so once the 
if you like the dashboard view you can click on the button save a view and you give a name in future whenever you want you can simply go to the option change view so for your information tally already added to predefined reports one is purchase dashboard and one more is a sales dashboard and if you are looking for any other views for the first time you need to delete and add your necessary tiles once if you like that report style and click on the button save view so that view will be saved in future whenever you want that view click on the button change view and select the saved view which you wanted to show and hit enter that report will come here automatically right so in this way you can use dashboard reports for data analysis in tally application right thank you